everyone zeddy here again today with another bonus news video because the nerfs have been basically announced on twitter um again giveaway going on as always um hundred dollars out of my pocket packs of your choice your whatever winner's choice um like comment subscribe to the channel um the, the giveaway video will be linked below i'm i'm on a loss for words because i was not expecting this today but gallon an impromptu twitter thread has gone over the changes for everything so april 26 on tuesday we will have a new update a new balance patch going live and we'll update both standard and wild as expected and well there's a lot of changes a lot of good ones and also a very noticeable uh, omission so let's go over it they start with wild kale Foss. it was a mistake it should not have been reverted and it is going to be re-nerfed. Kael'thas will now have every third spell cost one. So it'll stay at six mana. It actually has never existed in this form. So I believe this will be like the first ever card to be nerfed effectively four times. It'll go to seven. Um, it'll go to seven with a zero, a one cost or zero cost spell then seven with the one cost spell and now six with a one cost spell. So yes, it'll be six mana. Um, it's actually kind of almost a nerf to it on top of it because you can't even melon it if you wanted to like psych juicy psych melon it out for like combo shenanigans. So yes, it has been nerfed again. Thank you, Blizzard, for listening. It was a mistake. It happens and uh, basically they've admitted it by, you know, re-nerfing it. And I'm glad they were quick to do that because it was well you guys have seen it's literally destroyed the format so yes Kael'thas uh will be um changed and switcheroo is banned from wild and a lot of priest players are going to be upset about this um I we we talked about in the video this morning I struggled about finding a way of keeping the spirit of the card together while making it you know not a problem in wild and we'll talk about the change to make it standard um, which, uh, yeah, it, it basically, there's, there was no way to keep it this way in wild. So, um, yeah, they're making two changes to wild and these are very like historically for wild. We don't typically see changes, uh, this quickly. That's how damaging they've been to the format. That's why I push so hard, uh, to get them fixed, to get them corrected in wild so quickly, uh, because they have just been completely destroying the format. And Blizzard has recognized this, and uh, they're changing both of them. So, um, awesome. It's happened, or will be happening on Tuesday officially. We know exactly that. But standard. Standard also changes, which will affect Wild, of course. Um, we have Pirate Warrior being nerfed again. Um, it's now three pirates all the way across it still does not address the issue of the card. It really doesn't. Um, the Juggernaut still will summon insane weapons. It will still get Mr. Smite. As I said, there's no chance that Mr. Smite's gonna get nerfed because they love that card. It is not on the list here. Pyre Warrior will still be very good. It'll be worse in standard. Wild will be slightly worse, but it's still gonna be a meta defining card. It's still going to be tier one, tier two. They love their Pirate Warrior quest, and uh, they are going step by step to make sure it's uh, going to stay relevant in a high impact way. It's a very popular quest. It's very highly played. Um, I guess they feel like the more casual players love it, and they want to make sure it's top tier for them. Um, but yeah, one more pirate makes a big, you know, is it a big deal? We saw it last time. It didn't do a lot in wild it did quite a bit in standard but standard has so many cheap pirates that i'm just still not sure how much it slows it down but it's something right it's something um i'm, I'm sure a lot of people won't be thrilled but there is another nerf to pirate warrior this was the one the pirate i always thought was egregious right from the get-go is puffer fist the uh three four that does a damage every time you attack or like a one damage um like basically mini consecration every time you attack it will now have three health instead of four so that's good like that was what i i had pitched make it more fragile to aoe's like it didn't even die to a light bomb this card didn't even die to a light bomb this 
neutral three drop this it, it's crazy it's still an insanely good card it's still gonna go into every pirate deck it's still gonna go into demon hunter because the effect is crazy but it's a little bit easier to kill so that makes me happy and that's kind of what i had suggested it's no reason why a card can't be good but i just thought at four health it was egregious i really really did and then the switcheroos change for standard um will um now it swaps health that was one of the things i'd suggested so that you know the de you know like the deathwing thing instead of 12 12s you get two 12s right and you're still kind of having that you know still drawing two minions the reason it couldn't stay this way in wild is you have inner fire you have topsy-turvy you have all these you still could easily combo with stone Tusk boar in otk i, I saw people inner fire divine spirit and topsy all the time regardless you know people still did that anyway so yeah um i guess it was unavoidable not to ban uh, switcheroo from wild but it's kind of sad and i know priest players will be upset and i understand i try to this morning like try and figure out a way to not have it banned it just i, I see their situation they were in and I, I think that was probably the way to go and druid gets two nerfs but they're light they're really light uh, but one's really good uh first is miracle growth goes from eight uh, instead of seven they're not doing scales of anixia they're doing miracle growth and um this is the lighter of the nerfs they could have done to the spell cards for druid because uh, the survivability is more important for druid to survive from nourish into scales into miracle growth rather than you ramp and then you draw and then you miracle growth like this is a bigger deal in my opinion but still really hurts true this will really hurt them they can't you know just nourish into the big taunt their their options on seven are more limited but still you know not as impactful um and no nerf to guff guff is not on the list people are going to be really pissed off about that i'm biased i kind of like it but i think it's probably a mistake i think guff probably needed a change but kazakasan was also nerfed this is the biggest one this was the one i wanted the most uh, you have to play four other dragons this game to craft a, a deck of treasures. I wanted five, they went with four. But this fundamentally changes the card uh, in a positive way that you can't just throw it into any dragon deck. Um, you have, or any deck, sorry, and just cycle through and drop Kazakasan. You have to play four dragons. So right now with Druid, they only run Raybos and Nixia. So if they want to play this, they're going to have to throw in two more dragons um on to, or three more dragons on top of that right four other dragons so um it will change up that ramp druid you're seeing on ladder now they cannot just play kazakasan so they don't want to touch guff i get it because guff is like how they have basically they're building around druid the entire year you can tell that uh the way all the cards are so they have really hit kazakasan hard this is a significant change it's what i pitched for uh they hit miracle growth but they left scales and guff probably the two best ramp druid cards because they want ramp druid to be good and I'm, i appreciate that but i'll be interested to hear your guys' comments it's kind of controversial and uh, yeah no nerf to mr smite and pirate warrior gets a couple of nerfs but nothing crazy so there you go um these will go live on tuesday we'll have our review of the patch on wednesday all sorts of shenanigans and uh yeah let me know in the comments below what you guys think of all these changes i think they're relatively good um you know they didn't hold back on a lot of it so i i i applaud it but guff guff makes me worry skills of anixie makes me worry but we'll see kazakasan's a big deal anyways enough rambling let's talk about in the comments if you enjoyed the video please like and subscribe have a great day and stay salty my friends